this is because in Aotearoa way back then they, they weren't allowing our natural fibres into the country so we couldn't get our hands on the traditional fibres so we used what was at hand and what was at hand was videotape because of my husband's film company so it was a matter of you know using what was in your immediate surroundings. It picked up the light really beautifully and it makes a beautiful sound. The old tapes, of course, would have had a whole lot of material and yeah. whakapapa in them that you never saw. No, but right. they were still part of it. You know, there's a history, there's always a history there. It's not like it's a dead thing just because it's modern. VHS tapes, and there's such a thing of the past. What we're going to do, Suzanne, is we're adding in a little bunch of about 12 to 24 strands into the fitty here. This is the same kind of um, plait that we actually do when we're making Kiko brooms. So you can so. see it's like a hula skirt. It's quite slippery, but yeah, the length is the kind of issue, actually. It's like six metres that we need and a bit. I'm so happy to see my Pacific sisters again. Yeah! I love the camaraderie, actually, with you guys. I love it when we're all working together and... Just brings memories of us all being together and doing this, actually. It's been how many years? 25 years, and here we are, back in a room again, working collaboratively yeah. on a show. I love it. Yeah. It's magic. It's like, you know, your friends that you hardly see, and you just pick up where you left off, and it's awesome every time. Well, nothing's changed, really. <laughs> Pacific Sisters has always been a safe space, no matter what has gone on. <laughs> and there's been a lot, but it's always been a really safe space for everyone. It is such a pure delight. I can really just hardly wait to actually see how the public take on board our story.